Immaculate Mary, your praises we sing. You reign now in splendor with Jesus our King. Ave. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Some people think that there is no one to unload my problems. But the Lord says, come to me. Those who are heavy and with burden, I will unload it. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. How many of you are burdened with the sickness? Continuous sickness. Sometimes continuous sickness will bring contamination in our life. Because of better than some people hate them. And they may think, how long we have to take care of this person? Prolonged disease will bring contamination. But the Lord says, I will visit you when you are sick. I will unload your burden from your body. I will load it in my body. Matthew 8 to 17. Nobody has given this promise. Nowhere in the world. Except our Lord Jesus Christ. Who is present in the blessed sacrament. What is that promise? I will unload your burden. And I will load it in on my body. That is the process or the mystery of healing in the church. Jesus takes it. This sickness will not destroy you. It will not disturb you. Instead, Jesus will destroy it. That is his promise. And we have plenty, not only plenty, but thousands and thousands of testimonies around the world because of this online ministry. Not only people who come and confined in one place, but now the whole world turned like a divine mercy church. The whole world is turned like a divine, divine mercy, mercy church. church, single church, and in which all religions, caste, creed, language groups, all are coming. And all world and families are united through the altar of Logos. Am I right or wrong? Right. So all are connected now through the beads of Divine, Divine mercy. mercy. As we look into this rosary, it's all connected. In the same way the whole families and all human beings are connected, connected. through the string of Divine mercy. mercy. All are the beads of Divine Mercy. Are you not a beads of Divine Mercy? Yes, you are a bead of the divine mercy so you are connected and united together through the mercy and compassion of Jesus so we all are united together through one thread what is that one thread that is divine, divine mercy. mercy hallelujah hallelujah so all have a place in this divine mercy string all can be the part of it God is good all the time. All the time. God is Jesus good. is Lord now and now forever. And forever. Jesus, Jesus is Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Praise you, Lord. Praise you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Two boys fighting. I saw yesterday they were fighting at the counter. Two boys. One said, I am a divine mercy boy. If you are, the small one said, if you are a divine mercy boy, you should be very good. And good, you are saying God is good all the time, but you are very bad all the time. The small one said to the big one, and fight started. What is saying this big one? God is good all the time, all the time. The small one said, you are bad all the time, all the time you are doing bad things. 
So when we say God is good all the time, we have to be good to everyone all the time. Are you ready to do so? Lift up your hands. Be merciful as my father is merciful. Luke chapter 6, 36. Be merciful as my heavenly father is merciful. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let us lift up our hands and pray in gift or tongues. Nobody will understand what we pray. 1 Corinthians 14, 2. Nobody will understand what we pray. Bible says. But we are preaching the mysteries. We are praying the mysteries of God. Declaring the mysteries of God. Secretly, privately, to God alone. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank, you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. So nobody understands them. Since they are speaking mysteries in spirit, let us pray. Havala Raisholo Bala Salam Balahara Sahabara Hali Mila. Let all the intentions be fulfilled. Those who have come for this adoration, let their prayers be answered. Almighty and all powerful God. Almighty and all powerful God. Anoint everyone. Transform everyone. Give answer of the prayers of all. Have mercy on everyone. Transform everybody's life. Let there be sickness be healed. Problems be solved, enemies be subsided and transformed. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Keep our hands down. Today's promise word is again fulfilled in Psalm 63, verse 5. My soul shall be satisfied with the marrow and fatness. And my mouth shall praise you with joyful lips. Beginning the Divine Mercy Chaplet. You aspired Jesus, Jesus but, but the source so of life, dashed for the souls, and the ocean of mercy, opened up for the whole world, a found of life, and fathomable divine mercy. Envelop the whole world and empty yourself out upon us. O blood and water which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus, as a fountain of mercy for us, I trust in you. O Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. Blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He, he suffered under Pontius Pilate, who was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended, he descended into, into hell. hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and he is still at the right hand of the Father Almighty. From there, he will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of our saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, life everlasting. Amen. Nearly 5,000 young people are being blessed with marriage. Thank you, Their life settlement is going to happen. Nearly 2,800 couples who are childless are going to have uh, children in their holy matrimony. Thank you, Jesus. Today Praise we prayed you, for the you, release of these two groups of people. Thank you, young people who are not married, couples who have no children, and we prayed and removed this kind of blocks and bondages in the process of having a child. And also, we have removed the gamophobia so that people will make commitment in their marriage and they will properly settle in their holy matrimony. These two graces are given today from this pulpit. And 5,000 are blessed with the marriage. 2,800 are blessed with gift of children. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Praise you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. And the promise word is going to be fulfilled through the beats of these five decades. Amen. Testimony number 12. 
Philomena Barreto giving a testimony. My sister was suffering of cancer. When it is diagnosed, she was not depressed. Because of the testimonies from Logos Rati Center, I will defeat it. So she united with Christ suffering. And during the days of her suffering, she saved souls from purgatory. That's the first benefit when we suffer with Christ. Second benefit, our own sanctification. Our own purgatory is being healed, was cancelled. Third one, the people who are living in our present time receive gift of repentance, conversion of sinners. The fourth one, we will get a charism of the same line to heal the people who have the same type of problems. And the last one, we defeat the devil and laugh with God with a sarcasm and sarcastic approach because it cannot affect us. And finally, we will have a testimony. So these are the blessings during the days of our suffering. And uh, Philomena Barreto giving this testimony, she produced all these five results. Now she has a wonderful result. Being with glorified Jesus through this three o'clock adoration, she is a Logosian. Yesterday she did all the tests and all the tests came normal. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. All Jesus. glory and honor Thank to Jesus Lord. forever Praise. and ever. Amen. Amen. Brothers and sisters, when we Amen. are united with Jesus crucified through the interaction of the devil, our enemy, and the enemy went to God and got permission to persecute us, Job chapter 2 verse 3, humbled God and got his permission to persecute us and God allowed it. But when we come to this adoration, when God has given permission, God is laughing. Because when we do this adoration, Jesus has the power to cancel it. So that's why God is laughing at your problems. And looking at the face of the devil who got the permission and the weapons to torment you. But God laughing at you. You also smile and be with Jesus. Produce five good results during the days of your suffering. And finally, give one more result. That is testimony. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So those who are with Jesus, even though they are going through difficult situation now, they will produce some profit. Amen. Because Jesus has come as a Jew. They will not do a business where there is no profit. Whatever they do, they will make some profit. Jesus providentially happened to be in that group. So he teaches us to make profit out of our suffering. And finally, victory through testimony. This cross, crucifix, gives that testimony. Amen. Amen. And he is, he is risen. risen. He is risen. crucified. Risen. He is risen. He is crucified. He is risen. Now he is glorified. Crucified, risen, glorified. Many of you are already joined with the glorified Jesus. Some of you are going through the crucified Jesus. Some of you are waiting to have an anointing of the Holy Spirit as the Spirit descend upon the tomb of Jesus. So these are the three processes going to happen now. Those who are going through the suffering Christ or crucifixion, fear not. Those who are waiting for anointing of the Holy Spirit at the tomb, Nothing stands still, stagnation, fear not. Those who are already with the wonderful testimonies, with the glorified Jesus, glorify him. That's why the Lord says, My soul shall be satisfied with marrow and fatness, and my mouth shall praise you with joyful lips. Psalm 63, 5. Keep on lifting up our hands and praying. Eternal Father, Father I offer you, you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. 
for the sake of his sorrowful passion how must he on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion how must he on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion how must he on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion how must he on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion how must he on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion how must he on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion how must he on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion how must he on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion how must he on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion how must he on us and on the whole world keep on lifting up our hands and praise and thank god my mouth shall praise with a joyful lips of his glory lord we come to this day to worship you praise you in our family lift up our hands glorify his holy name praise and thank him lord mercy on my family your goodness will fill our home lord we come to you this day come and do our lives we pray all our tears and toils we bring to you we worship you as a family lord we worship you as one family those who are in need of blessings in families lift up your hands those who are in need of blessings in their finances business transactions career the lord almighty says proverb 3 9 through your wealth and substance glorify god almighty it is for glory of god and in our family we have to glorify god it is a domestic church sirach 25 1 God rejoices seeing a wonderful family make God very happy in our family having unity among the siblings wonderful fellowship and relationship between husband and wife and also there is peace among the neighborhood God rejoices and showering all his blessings there in the name of Jesus I bless your family with sirak 251 amen amen i bless your finances with the promise word in proverb 39 the lord may help you to glorify him more and more in your family and in your finances amen. the lord may give you enough and more to fulfill all your responsibilities towards your partner and children and grandchildren and towards your nation and towards your church ിൽ will make you rich and make your effort fruitful amen without effort you will not become rich because there is a promise your effort will become fruitful amen hallelujah hallelujah